How are we doing today? Right, I want to show you open valve mode on the set free VRF system. So only needs to be done on that, everything else can be done on either side of the pipes, but for the set free VRF system, it needs to be done. So, super simple. So, DSW4, so that needs to be up, so that's what it is in its default state. So, set it up. So that's going to stop your compressor from running. So if you're ever doing any testing and you do not want your compressor to run, pin 4 of DSW4 on. And then all you can do is press and hold PSW4 for a couple of seconds. There we go. Clear it all opening up. If you ever want to come out of that mode, just drop it back down. Why is this so useful? So the open valve mode allows you full access to all the pipe work inside the outdoor CH boxes and the indoor. As you can see from the diagram below on the set free system, the greyed out area is an area where you could have refrigerant or air trapped behind the valves. If this is an application where the system has already been installed and you're carrying out a system wide pressure test, evacuation or reclaim, you will want to put it into open valve mode to get full access to the system. It's also a useful mode to use if this is a new installation and you believe one of your CH boxes or indoor units has been powered up accidentally, resulting in the closure of one of the valves. You can open valve mode to allow full access to all the pipe side stuff, opening up any valves in the CH boxes and indoor units, allowing you to carry out a full pressure test, evacuation or recovery. Hope it helps. Cheers guys. Bye bye.